hello guys well come back all right I'm going to do a tutorial how to create a tiny 11 what is mean tiny 11 a deep lot Windows 11 and after that I'll show you what the impact the effect of the deep load Windows 11 and let's begin tool we need of course tiny 11 you just type in your Google search search for the tiny 11 and don't download from other website please get it from the github direct from the developer this is the developer right over here all the instruction what to do how to use it all right to get the file download the zip write and extract this is the mine over here Move it to move it to your desktop, and the Windows. Which one you use for the Renegade project? Well, UUP dump. From here, get the public release this one more stable and 95 percent chances of putting maybe 100 percent depend on your driver also uh, 64 for pc and arm 64 for your device right this is the cumulative this is the lattice release and next get the pro next over here if you if you are a gamer you can include this uh, net framework so you don't have to reinstall it back create download package Okay, we got the package. Also, unzip. This is the file. All right, we already get this tiny eleven. The UUP dump, the downloader, and this downloader you cannot run in your native drive that means your C drive you cannot run it inside here if you want to see you will get an error run It's download also. Actually, well, normally I copy the folder in the external drive or other drive. Maybe this one still inside the. Not sure. So what happened? 
Ja, jag har det. Standard uh, Windows 11 Arm 64 The public release The download may take time that depend on your network right and other file that we need for this uh, let me not 9s you can go to the renegade project the device at the moment that are uh, support GSX, uh, LG GSX, GSX, GTS abandoned, this Lumia also still active, OnePlus, I'm not sure, a lot of problem, Mix 2S, okay, Poco F1, okay, Mi 8, abandoned, Mi 9, well, don't do it, Nabu, let me know, uh, let me, uh, sorry, Xiaomi Pad 5, it's not a pro, this one a normal one. This one active, Poco X3 Pro also active. Thanks to the, the proper for maintaining the source 9 Pro 9S me at all. This one you're going to install the windows inside this one, right? Over here, all the instruction what you need to do what the file necessary for the windows installation the TWRP orange box recovery make sure your PC with the latest ADB and test it before you do any of this installation the fast boot this is a must otherwise you may get an error and all the steps are here we are going to the download the image file the UEFI also driver updater and the last one driver over here get the latest one EFI image I already download this uh, ISO so on your desktop as for me I create a new folder Kutana right another one get the uh, windows 64 if you got a 64 bit pc this one for the 32 bit maybe better don't install the windows it's too old baby windows 7 maybe don't do it my advice down please don't right the last one drivers to EFI this one extract Me at all drivers almost finish download the drivers extract also really throw the 
zip extractor and windows i prefer the 7 zip better use 7 zip 7 zip is much faster megabyte per second this might be a long video so sit back and relax seven zip let's see well seven zips extract file see how fast the seven zip and less errors well, goodbye Windows. Help. 7xx drivers. Right, that's it. And copy this to or cut to your drivers folder capital D capital U right now creating the tiny 11 okay my download file almost ready but I already download it before my file are over here oh no inside here Windows 11 ISO I'm using all public release. This one, the older one, 1929. This is the 22621, 1848, 22621, 1702. This is the latest one. Get to our here. Right. Now creating the uh, tiny eleven. This is important for the low storage device, sixty four gigabyte. You need to create the tiny eleven, the deep load windows because it use less space all right 2261 public release this one uh, preview so run as administrator Right, you need to mount this uh, Windows ISO. Look at the drive. Oh, please enter the drive letter. Small letter, big letter, doesn't matter. Oh, now it copy the image to the builder. don't exit this one right the index remember this one windows index one just 11 pro enter one and enter now it creating the tiny 11 windows 11 after this i show you how to install this uh, Windows 11, tiny 11, very tiny, 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 the size If your PC powerful enough, your processing time uh, much faster For the older PC, well, not much you can do to speed up the process Maybe half hour, one hour, I'm not sure because I'm using the i5 12th gen series 
and 16 gigabyte of memory DDR4 clock at 3600 megahertz. Yes, we complete. Press any key. Press any key. Nope. Right, this is the tiny 11 of Sears pick the size. Not much different compared to the the one I create before. Let's buy it. Buy it. Well, this tiny 11, copy it over here. Now, Windows installation. Alright guys, well, now it's time to install the tiny 11. Let's begin installing the Windows 11. What you need? Command prompt, run it as administrator. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Because our Windows not yet mount the other ESP partition, right? Okay, let's begin installing the Windows. Open the terminal as admin. I'm using Windows 11. Right, this part. Example over here, my drive uh, a lot. This is all the external drive. This drive are J. Our Windows on the 9S, right? List all the disks. We need only the 9. The last one. Always look at the last one. 55 GB. This is a uh, size of the storage after resize so select this 9 after you select this 9 list all the partition inside this bar all right system primary this is the windows this is the esp partition and this one user data hgpmd well, right since mine already got the windows if you want to update the driver only also can if you want to update both also can now select bar 15 I'm going to format the ESP partition What is that? How much quick? FS the file system are uh, FAT thirty two and the level. Well, uh, we give it a system. System. Format quick file system pad 32 on the ESP partition and the level as system right after that you need to assign the letter for this partition number 18 because it over here you can see it all right assign letter I'm using S now S are visible see just now it still and 
the right uh, the format is now we're going to format the uh, J partition of us here but our uh, I will rename it to W system and W for Windows right the windows are this one partition 19 so select pa 19 right pa 19 already selected format quick mm, just now the SP are on fat we, we want this one our system and the has all right level windows right format quick file system and tfs and the level uh, windows we're going to format uh, j over here is j all right assign the letter now assign letter w i'm going to rename it w easy to remember s system w windows all right exit this one exit the all right we're going to install the tiny windows 11 open the command from s administrator tiny 11 you mount this uh, ISO go to source because we need the uh, executor installer install win or install execute this one right DISM space apply apply image space Backslash I capital I and capital F column and the executor wim dot wim the install dot wim or install dot execute on some file copy as pub space just now our windows are in deck column one in deck one space slash apply to the directory which directory w w we're going to install the windows inside here directory column again capital uh, letter W call them again next slash apply image space apply file image file this is the executor the index are one because as well just now are uh, index one and enter this may take time maybe 10 minutes so get a copy our pawn still inside the TWRP the windows you mount just now don't eject it after the installation complete you can eject it just now I show you at, at GB uh, for Android the rest 
Where are they gone? That is 55 GB. Why this one 36? All right. Operation complete successfully. Now driver installation this driver don't cross the command prompt we still in admin you need to change directory to the driver folder so cd this driver folder copy as pub space over here space and enter now we are in the directory right inside the directory the driver execute we need to execute this uh, driver updater start with the dot backslash dot backslash the update driver update capital D and U dot EXT space minus D space the definition file inside your driver folder definition desktop arm64 internal me at all copy as pub and paste here space minus r space and copy the folder address copy as pub paste space again minus p mm, space capital letter w because my partition for windows are w column text -less. You execute the driver execute the driver updater over here space and this one is the definition file the location of the definition file the at all inside desktop good China Windows this is a location for this file and then location for the, the driver folder the second one after minus r and then enter now we installing the driver you could you can do this for updating the driver also it will reinstall the previous driver uninstalling driver and reinstall the new one if you got the update of the driver that's the way you update the driver don't reinstall the windows only if you want to change the windows maybe you want to try some other windows you reinstall back the windows reformatting the windows drive also don't forget to format the EFS drive to drive the system and the windows see 20 GB left 16 GB occupied if you don't use a tiny uh, 11 maybe 12 GB left
because tiny 11 uh, use less storage already complete you can close this one now we're going to uh, open the terminal as admin if you don't do this uh, you will get a blue screen of that you change the boot configuration to the system everything put here so when windows want to boot all the configure uh, inside here so this partition mustn't be corrupt so don't whatever you do in windows this system uh, this uh, drive don't disturb it that your boot configuration all right pcd boot mm, capital letter w because we are using the W windows express S and capital letter S the drive where I want to put the configuration S slash F U E F I. That's it. Enter. File successfully create inside here. Right. This one also important. Otherwise, you must uh, on the test signing. Testing. That's when you testing the Windows. Otherwise, you may get a blue screen of that because you didn't off the test signing. So, PCD edit. E set as default test signing on store the s all right yeah, enter this one forgot this one
as signing on okay complete okay can exit this one now you can restart your phone boot to boot loader reboot to fast boot fast boot or boot loader that two different this is a fast boot knob boot loader actually it's a boot loader fast boot mm, all right we're going to flash the you can eject this one that's the UAFI to the boot before that you back up your Android boot image in your external storage SD card now we're going to press the boot Xiaomi Mi Atal UFI Flash the boot. Now, finish. Restart your phone. That's it. After this, what happened when we installed the Tiny Eleven? outcome this is the latest one I'm using the older one version one get this one this one also boot this one also boot but this one better Way I get it just now, maybe from here. So, this is the latest one. Use this Xiaomi Mi at all. press this one this one on first May this one on the third day redo the touch if you are using washing get the washing if you are using Chanma get the Chanma reboot to bootloader all your volume minus and press the power button still holding the volume minus in a boot loader we're going to press the washing washing it's now I'm using me at all no wonder you see the the script there all red so fast boot flash boot get this one washing washing Why are you like this? The driver 
hundred point. No wonder. You know why? Cable not connected. What a dumb. So always be careful. Don't make mistake. I'm still uh, in a hub. This is my. Right. That this here will see the error maybe let's see now it's perfect I'm using the older UEFI image just now where Windows 11 after this we will see the benefit of the tiny 11 just keep a secret uh, wow. Very tiny the cursor. Can you see the cursor? Yes. Keyboard, yes. After this, you will see. What the benefit of Tiny 11? This one, I don't have internet. On the standard Windows 11, uh, as all, you don't have this option. You have to use command uh, to disable the login to the Microsoft account you can search on the net how to disable if you don't use the tiny 11 where's my keyboard my keyboard 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 Continue with limited setup. Okay, hold on, I connect my keyboard. All right, keyboard connected. Except. Oops, sorry. Enter your name. Any password will do. Confirm password. And over here. Whatever. But better. Hey, where's my mouse cursor? Uh, well, up there. Security. First question. First answer. One. And next. Second question. Your answer. One. Right, here's my cursor. Wow. The third question, the last one. Oh, sorry. Childhood. Next time. 
let's follow it in order your answer also one finish that's it after this all the unnecessary you can untick if you don't want to use it better don't use it oh yes my cushion my cushion wow move so fast this arrow this arrow this arrow the auto update also this arrow yes except you can recover because your battery are still full so the touch screen are working well you see the Microsoft Edge actually this one just the uh, empty icon because the the browser already removed so you can remove the shortcut well that's it we start the pawn and everything should be okay once again thank you for watching stay tuned for the next video